Hello everyone, Crow back again with another gameplay video. This game was requested by Metal Jesus Rocks. He wanted to see me play some Archon on the NES. I know a lot of people have seen this and said it was and, and called it Archon, but no, it's actually Archon. And the thing I'm finding uh, unusual about this game, well, I used to play this a lot on the Commodore 64. I've never played the NES version, but the um, but the original version of the game was actually made by Electronic Arts. And this has go. Oh, that's not good. Let's try one more time. I just hit it in there. Man, it's a tight fit. Okay, just pause for a second until I fix this. There we go. All right, we're back up. <laughs> um, yeah, this is a game by originally by Electronic Arts. Um, published by Electronic Arts, uh, but Activision actually published the NES version of this game, and I just find that kind of weird. Now, I kind of seen this game before. Uh, I think I'm gonna, I prefer the uh, the Commodore 64 version actually. Uh, the title screen that you see here is a lot rem more reminiscent of the actual cover of the Commodore 64 game, and honestly, I think that cover is the best cover to any video game ever. So, let's jump in. One player. Uh, should I be the light side or the dark side? Oh, it's a decisions, decisions. I'm going to be the light side, I guess. Uh, let's make it random. Uh, I haven't played this in a long time. Each side has kind of different pieces, but they're pretty much similar. Um, the objective of this game is to either destroy every piece on either side of the board, or, you know, destroy your, all your enemy's pieces, or occupy one of five glowing spots. Looks like I'm going first. So your first spot is here. You have three spots in the middle, and then you have this other spot. So if you get to occupy those five spots, you win. Um, I wonder if by destroying the either the wizard or the sorcerer, you win too. That might be another rule. I can't quite remember 100% sure for sure. Another uh, thing about this game is that uh, where you see this blue, these blue marks, you have these uh, light marks, these dark marks, and then you have this blue, and this blue's area will keep color cycling. And um, the advantage here is that if your character is on, if you're a light character and you're in a light spot, okay, yeah, I can move three with this guy, so I'll move him here. Uh, but if you're on a light spot, you're stronger. Uh, but if you're in a dark, you're a dark character and you're in a dark spot, then you're stronger. Um, so there's some strategy there. Also, when you attack another piece, it goes into a battle arena uh, where you actually have to fight the other piece. Uh, these grunts are like the, um, <laughs> the the weakest of the characters. Um, let's see what we got here. This is a phoenix. I can fly the phoenix. I'm just going to take the middle spot here. I haven't played this in a long time. And, and even when I did play this, I, I really had no strategy to playing it. <laughs> Let's take this guy and move him um, right here. So I'm, I'm basically playing with no strategy. Uh-oh. Okay. So, like, you basically have one attack. Oh, crap! Oh, that's right, the phoenix. Um, I, can't, I have to get near him and explode. Uh, the Commodore 64 version, I know, was... Um, had just kind of simpler graphics. These graphics are a little bit more detailed for the NES. Ooh, got him a little bit there. Ooh. Got him a little bit there. Got him a little bit there. Oh, he got me! Oh, that's a waste. I love the Phoenix, too. There's also an Archon 2, which I also happen to like flying. Let's see if I can just take this dragon. Oh, crap, he's in a dark spot, too. So he's gonna... Yeah, he's gonna take this guy out in one hit. Oh, man, that was not good. Well, I'm off to a rip-roaring start. Yeah, okay, yeah, and so the sorcerer and the wizard can uh, conjure up spells as well. And it looks like he's trying to take out this genie guy here. Ooh, man, he doesn't reload that quick. Oh shit, he got me. One more hit, I'm dead there. Oh, man! I'm just playing this awfully, aren't I? Well, 
well, let's see, I got a unit. Oh, yeah, that's right, those elementals don't last that long. So let's see what I can do here. Um, I can teleport. Is that all I can do? Imprison. Revive. Summon elemental. Exchange. Shift time. Oh, yeah, that's where you can reverse the time to, you know, put the area to your fail. Heal, heal teleport. Um, I want to revive. I want to revive my phoenix. Place it within the charmed squares. So is that this? Power points are proof against the magic. Oh, so I can't put that there, I guess. I guess the charm squares is like this. There we go. So I got my phoenix back. This guy, Valkyrie. Let's get the Valkyrie on him. Ooh, got him once there. Yes! Ha! Yes! <laughs> Finally took out one of his pieces. Oh, he's imprisoning my Phoenix? That means I can't move him. Um, what should I do now? Huh? Let's take this archer and move him to that square here. Alright, and um, let's attack this shapeshifter with this knight. Oh, the shapeshifter changes into him! Making it a fair fight, basically. Ah, yes, I got him! Ha ha! Okay, we have my Valkyrie. I actually like the way the characters looked in the Commodore version better, ironically. I think the, I thought the Valkyrie looked a lot more impressive. Completely white square, let's try and take out this dragon. Oh, damn! Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh! No! <laughs> I'm losing so bad. And I can't move my Phoenix. Oh, I can move him now. Let's take him out. Come on, take out that bastard. Got him! Yeah! Take that! Ha! Who's he's gonna take him off there, huh? Alright, now I have three of the five. Can I revive anybody? Exchange, shift time, teleport. Let's teleport somebody. I will teleport him over here. Alright. Okay, the golem is trying to take me out now. Nice. Nice one right there. Nice one! Got that golem! Yeah! What I need to do now is revive him. Although, it might not work. Because he's on the power pad. Oh, 
Oh, I don't even have those spells. I'm so weak. Let's see if I can take this guy out. Well, nobody's on a white spot over there. It's a problem. I have to do this the hard way. Come on, you. Oh, got too close. Damn it. And I oh, fuck. Oh, hey, double kill, yeah! Ho-ho! Oh, nobody wins that one! Now the Banshee's trying to take out the Phoenix. This'll be hard, because they both have to get close to each other. Got him, yeah! Yeah, <laughs> I love the Phoenix. have my wizard <laughs> start attacking people now. Yeah! <laughs> my troll attacking the wizard. Or not my troll, his troll. Well, I've got a way faster shot, and, uh... Damn. Oh! We took out my wizard! Is the game over? No! They gotta take out every... You know what? Yeah, screw that. My phoenix is taking out his sorcerer. It's like down to the last shot for both of us. I got her! Yeah! <laughs> oh, it's just gonna be interesting, isn't it? Yeah! <laughs> Let's see how long my Phoenix can last. on a white spot now, so I should have more power. Oh! That's it! Oh! <laughs> I thought I had him. I thought I had him for sure, but man, his attacks are too powerful. The game has ended! 67 turns, the dark side wins. Well, there you go. That's Archon on the NES. I'm sure I'm going to have to edit this up because I've actually been playing for 25 minutes. Fun game, though. Uh, even more fun with two people. Thanks everyone for watching. See y'all next time. Bye. Da 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 da. Lame. Bum bum. Lame bum.